All right, welcome back. In today's video, this is for YouTubers. Uh, if you're starting out uh, and you want to hide your subscriber count, this is how you do it in YouTube. Uh, why would you want to do this? Uh, maybe perception. Say you're starting your channel out and you have one or two subscribers. You have good content. You are doing the work. You're hustling. You're putting out videos. But, oh my God, there's only one subscriber. People come and see it and go, well, what's going on? There's only one subscriber. It's that little little trigger people say, oh, a perception that, oh, maybe there's something wrong with the channel. So this is a way just to block it. You just keep doing your job, keep doing the hustle, putting out the videos, do the work, and uh, don't worry about the subscriber count. It is viewer watch time over the number of subscribers anyway for the algorithm. Even if you're monetized or not, YouTube will still put ads on your videos whether you're monetized or not because it's their platform and they want to make some of that yummy money. Uh, once you get monetized, you'll get a small, small pittance of that money. That's why you need to have other side hustles like affiliate marketing, Amazon links, other stuff to lead them off-site to your site so you can make some real money and you're not completely dependent upon this platform. So remember, viewership watch time is the key component, not subscribers. Actually, total number of subscribers in a way hurts you because then they'll use that to say, well, you got this many subscribers, but you don't have any watch time. So you got to think about that watch time. So just put out decent content. And the major thing I would say for people is do the rule of 100. Whether you're going to do anything, say videos and YouTube, do it for at least 100 videos. Just keep working. Put out stuff. Make it halfway decent. Sometimes it's hard to be creative or come up with ideas. But do the rule of 100, and you will be amazed at what happens after you get to that 100 level. So how do you do it? On your channel right here, I am on my channel in YouTube. Go up to your little icon in the upper right. Kablamo, go to YouTube Studio. Switch on over. And for me, it's always slow. It's wondered, what are they doing to this platform? They're just making it worse. Um, Go over now to the left, bottom, settings, on the bottom left. Click on settings. All right, under settings, go to the second option, channel. And now you want to go over to the main dialog that popped up, advanced settings. Click on that. Scroll down. Dun, dun, dun. See this thing, subscriber count? All you have to do is uncheck it and then save it. Dun, dun, dun. Let's go back to your channel. Kablamo, come on, big money, big money, YouTube. Look, it's gone. Up here, it used to appear right here under your label. But the, the, the subscriber count is now gone. There you go, a little how-to video in YouTube world. Uh, other things you can do is in that settings thing I showed you, if you go back, and we'll talk about these later, YouTube Studio is kind of your friend, even though it's very clunky and slow. All right, so there you go, a little how-to, how to disable and hide your subscriber count on your YouTube channel. Remember, it's watch time over subscriber count anyway, so don't fret it. I mean, just hide it. It's useless anyway. Make videos that people want to watch, learn from, and contribute to, and you will have a good experience. Keep churning. Do the work.